This is a lesson from our Editing Foundations course. To get the full course, go to bloopanimation.com slash editing foundations. A color grade is different to color correction and that we're looking to add a particular style to the piece. For instance, we can make it super contrasty and moody. Or we could make it more saturated and colorful. There's a whole lot of different ways to make and apply color grades. For instance, you could apply a color grade to the entire timeline and then adjust all of the individual clips that need to be adjusted. The approach we'll be using in this tutorial is to create a color grade for one clip and then apply that color grade to all of the other clips at once. Let's start off with this clip. Let's create a new node by right clicking, selecting Add Node, Add Serial. The look I'm going for is for the film to have a feeling of a bright sunny day. I'll do this by making the overall image brighter and then move around various aspects to balance it back out. In the white balance section, I'll push the white balance up to about 1400. This should give everything a yellow cast. This also makes the shadows a bit magenta, so we'll counteract this by pulling the tint down by about negative 25. To brighten the image, I'll bring up the gamma to about 0.05. To bring up the shadows as well, I'll adjust the lift to about 0.03. Next, I want to add some colour to the highlights and shadows. I'll add just a hint of blue in the lift tint, and a bit more yellow in the, in the gain tint. I'll also push the colour boost up to about 40 as well, which should really make our colours feel a lot more saturated. To finish off, let's label this node by right clicking, selecting node label, and label it as colour grade. So now that we have our color grade, we need to apply it to the rest of our clips. We can do this using the gallery. First, on our graded clip, we can delete any color correction nodes we don't want applied to our other clips. Then we can go to the viewer window, right click and select grab still. Then we can press Ctrl Z to bring back our color correction node if we need to. Next, I want to select all of the clips by clicking on the first one, holding shift and then clicking on the last one. We can unselect our already graded clip by holding Ctrl and clicking on it, as we don't need to reapply the grade on that clip. Then in the gallery, we can right click on our graded still image and select Append Node Graph. Now, if we take a look at the whole piece, we should have a color grade applied to all of the shots. If we have a look at their node graphs, the color grade has been applied after all of the color corrections that we've added. If any shots stick out to you as needing a bit more attention, you can just add a new node and apply any changes you need. 